All right, here we go. Oh God. He's still not getting up. I don't know if I want to step into there. I feel like something's gonna happen when I step into here. I don't want to do it. I'm sorry, you're getting closed. I'm going this way. I mean, this also seems like a bad place to go, but it's a small room at least. Seems like a good place to have a battery or something. Oh look, it's a little Buddha. Hey man, let's put him gently back on the. Whoops. Never mind. There's a physics equation at the top. Sort of. It's like an acceleration equation, force and acceleration equation. Okay, cool. <laughs> I wanted to place it back respectfully, but I, I fumbled. <laughs> Cortex chip, hey. Tom's Motor Optics. Oh, wait, what? Okay, so you need all three of them. Can we stop that? Uh, should I be worried about that? Is it going to try and stab me? kind of fumbled my way into that. Okay, I did something, now things are going to start getting bad. Okay, he still didn't get up. Alright, here we go gonna suck. Jeez, oh, maybe only after I get all three parts? I knew something was going to happen at least. Oh god, I'm going to come back here, that guy's going to be moved. 
I'm backing it up. Something's happening out there. checking on this guy. I don't know why. Okay, I think I opened a bunch of things up here. So I guess let's go up, back up and, and look. A bunch of doors I unlocked. And then there's a whole third floor that I wasn't able to get to before. Okay, I'm worried about this guy at the end of the hall. these doors, but maybe not. Here we go. Oh. Thought I heard something. Uh. Ruffy. Johan Ross. Oh. What has happened down in the abyss? God, I don't want to go down to the abyss. Well, most of these things are still locked. Wait. Oh, midsection lockdown. Oh, I did lower section lockdown already. Okay, okay. I see. Oh, it worked? God, God, God. Okay. These doors too? Oh no, all these doors are open. Oh, that guy... Did that guy move? Let me, uh... Just take a quick look at him before... Or anything. Okay, that's how you get to the upper section. South stairwell. Okay. Well, let's check this first. Hydroponics. That seems like a pretty innocent place. Nothing bad ever happens in hydroponics, right? Man, something exploded over here. I'll grab that in a moment. Let me just have a look around first. I do think that was like an important thing, right?
Oh, for some reason I thought that was important. I guess not. Well, nothing at all happened in hydroponics, I guess. You see what happened? Well, I don't want to go upstairs yet. We'll look at the rest in this floor. Can't wait until he cuts out the power again. Clean room. Uh, I don't want to go there yet. Let's go into the laboratory first. In fact, let's look on the map and see what are the big rooms. <laughs> Biologic laboratory, biomech laboratory. So there's hydroponics. Biomech rat laboratory is behind me, I guess. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. Cold storage. A fish! That one's freaking out. There's one of the sphincters, which I don't want to touch. Basically a confirmation. Like, how is that anything except for a confirmation? This room looks harmless. Looks cool though. All, all these fish are messed up. They've been mutated. Cool. They're frozen in ice. Somebody left their dissections out. freaking scary too. Anything that saw me would start noping out of there. That's pretty cool. I, I thought something was gonna freaky was about to appear in the mirror behind me, but no, it was just me appearing in the mirror. Seems like a super bad idea to touch that thing in here, but you know, we're gonna do it anyway. Here we go. Lights are going to turn out. Destroy them while they last. Yep. Hey, uh, seriously, Clue. You look in the mirror and you're not what you expect you are? Like, that's pretty crazy. Ultimately, there was nothing in this room, I guess. I 
feel like something's creeping around outside now. I keep looking there, expecting that guy to get up and start chasing me. No, Ontario, but the whole thing is this guy feels like... He, he feels like he's... Is he contained inside this box? Every time I've seen him, he's been contained in that, like that thing. I've, I've seen him contained inside this box. I hope that box doesn't open. This box is going to open later. Was this blood here before? Where is this trail? This trail is going into there. Oh my god, is this new? This is new. Well, I think at this point he's gotten used to it. Look, some drunk dude came in here. Drunk and dead person. Not really. But it stopped here. Where'd he go? Oh yeah, muted emotions. He's had some time to come to terms with it at this point. Okay, so I've done I've looked everywhere here, I think. Let me take one quick look. I think this area is still safe. Assuming you're like a robot fully capable of feeling surprise, you know? Okay, everything is as I left it. Cool. Alright, good. So back to the biomech lab, which is the only other thing on this floor. Oh, here we go. Why do we have so many friggin' doors? Oh, clean room, right? This looks delightful. Somebody leave the shower running? I don't know what that is. Oh my god, they... So, these the black boxes are overloading. So, <laughs> assuming they are in their head, the WoW amplified them and made them head ex literally explode their heads. Jeez. Two seconds? 
the computer screen freaking out over there? Oh, this is at the two second mark, okay. We just start out. This is at three hours later. It's growing. What did what did they inject into it? Eleven hours. It's like the friggin' Borg. It's growing weirdly like the Borg. Check previous results. Systemic shock. I mean system shock? Death. Task till something. S something out at something something data. Structure gel test formula circuit Interpre interpretation phase no death phase. Oh, if you keep adding structure gel, no death phase. Circuit mimicked. Wow. Okay. Biosafety cabinets. Let me just lock myself in one of those for the rest of the game. The structure gel has been charged and actually keeps going for a while, even when removed from a power source. Applied to circuits seems to help out with connectivity. Oh, so this area is all about structure gel. current with the animal. Interesting. <laughs> Everybody's dead. I yeah, alive in quotes. Is this the mouse that they were experimenting on? I wonder. Never seen something of that speed. Oh, whoa. So that is structure gel. Uncalibrated. So I guess I have the ability to, like, activate some structure gel or something. do this
Jeez. Reanimated. Came back to life. Or something like it. I shouldn't have done that. Dang it. Dang it. I bet I'll have to fix this in some other room. Or no, wait, here? Oh, wow. Ew. Uh, I don't know where to take this yet. I guess I'll find out. Oh. Really? This is this is what I should do? Put some structure gel on it? Really? <laughs> Alright, this seems like a terrible idea, but I'll do it anyway, because it gives me the option. Fixed. Definitely no problem with this. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Oh boy, here we go. <laughs> it just fixes things. So that's one thing off. Oh, I got two things out of this. I need a power pack. It's probably on level three. Here we go. When I get to level three, he's gonna bust. He's gonna bust loose. It's gonna be bad. <laughs> yeah, gosh, exactly. <laughs> Man, I guess I need to go with level three. Here we go. This guy's come coming to life. Uh Literally? People kept using it to mean figuratively. Which I suppose is acceptable, but is also kind of annoying. So I censored it. Put it on the list! Wow, this place looks... delightful. Oh boy. Oh boy. Mm. Hey, cure. Anyways, uh, I've been guilty of anyways.
Oh, I'm gonna have to do this lockdown thing over here, so I should probably just do that now. I don't like that rumbling. loud and stuff. I'll allow anyways. You stay well. The tower room sounds like exactly where I need to go, so let's go elsewhere first. Let's go get a bite to eat at the dining hall. Man. Worst dining hall ever. Nothing's good is gonna happen when I touch that weird sphincter thing. What was that guy reading that made his head explode? Evil chicken chow mein. <laughs> Food so good, it blew his mind. That's probably what happened, right? Oh my god, <laughs> just, just get on down there next to him. Johan Ross was found dead on the climate this morning. The ARC team went down a couple of days ago, but I see no reason to suspect them playing a part in his death. The climber can't be operated from the abyss, so there was a scheduled retrieval. The climber returned with only the lifeless body of Alpha member Johan Ross. No traces of the ARC team. Cameron Eames Lansky, all studying the body inside containment. I'll follow up with whatever they find. Delenda S. Dude. Uh. The abyss is gonna be so scary. The WoW has been getting more aggressive, pushing all systems to their limits. Ironically, the dead Dr. Johan Ross would be the perfect person to ask why the WoW is making such a big buzz about his passing. Hmm. After all, the WoW isn't supposed to want anything. And definitely not to mourn people. Hmm. Maybe Johan Ross. System overload affects the staff considerably. Infected the wow. Headaches, loss of sleep, unwarranted stress. And it seems to be getting worse. I could use some advice if you can get through. Delenda Est. Things are out of hand. The staff looks like they're about to explode. Every other person walks around with nosebleeds. And the rest keep wiping stains of blood from their eyes to keep them from overflowing. To do with the WoW trying to free Ross somehow for sure. Free At Ross. this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the body just got up and left. Oh my god. Rally Herber, our dispatcher, has been snooping around asking questions she shouldn't. She says she's going down into the abyss to find Alpha. That didn't work. I can't bring myself to stop her. Oh, dude, she almost made it.
Oh man, there's a lot to read here. Omega sector swallowed by darkness. Ooh boy. Something big had almost cut her in two. That doesn't seem good. Oh, Alpha. This guy's talking about Alpha. What's up, Jaeger? Welcome to the stream. One of these is going to be freaky. Huh? One of these images is not like the others. That l Oh, thanks, Jaeger. Are you one of the people who watched... Remind me, are you one of the people who watched, like, every episode of one of, like, my Dark Souls 2 series or something? Uh, that lady kept uh, signing off with Delenda Est, which is a reference to classical history, if I remember right. Carthage Delenda Est means Carthage de is destroyed, or has been destroyed. I think it was set after um, like the Phoenician War or something. This has already been used? That's new. I haven't been here. Okay, I'm thinking this about somebody else there. Anyway, thanks. <laughs> Is that guy gonna punish me for having gone into the into the dining hall? Oh, is this where I couldn't get in before? I guess I should check this. This room looks awful. That guy... Hmm. <laughs> That's probably true. Yeah, so this must be where... First attack, is this the other side of the door where I, came, where I would have tried to come in and it wouldn't have worked? Irregardless, yeah, I don't like irregardless. You can do irrespective or regardless, but you can't have irregardless. I should, I should censor that one. I could 
care less, yeah. I love storage rooms. There's yet another that has nothing in it, seemingly. Is that a gun? Just hook me up with that. No, nope, that's not a gun. I don't know what that is. Inflammable, inflammable. Okay, here we go. Power room. Oh, this is important enough that they put a checkpoint right in front of it. Or save point. Oh, dude. You, you know what's going to happen in here. Time to mentally prepare myself for... Lights are going to go off. Something's going to come after me. Air duct is going to open up. I got to crawl for my life. That guy's twitching. That guy is hooked up to that. Yeah, that's not great. Face cam for the whole playthrough. I've been doing this playthrough with face cam. Yeah, that's not great. That guy is probably coming alive. I think he specifically is probably coming alive and coming after me. Somebody took the power pack, that's great. This is a perfect room to be chased in. I feel like I've been chased in a room identical to this. Yup, here goes, there he is. I see one. Air ducts, another air duct. Can I sneak up on him and pull the power pack off him? Is it just one guy? You got taken. You got possessed. You got possessed. Oh God. Okay. I'm sorry. You said get away from me. I'm getting. Didn't, didn't mean to. God, I gotta go. I gotta go over there, don't I? Maybe I can throw a box at him or something. I think something happened. Oh God! I don't think that worked. He's right there! I'm not gonna make it!
like right there, dude. I got the box. I mean, I think I got the box. I looked at the the cabinet and it was empty. Now everybody's waking up. This is going to be bad. Okay, how do I get back down? Oh no. Oh god. Oh no. Is that guy gone? He's freaking gone. I knew it. Oh god. Another checkpoint. Which means another bad thing's about to happen. Here we go. This is gonna be bad. Oh god! I think I got out of the box. He's been waiting to get out of that box the whole game. <laughs> He's gotta hide in the name. I have to go through here is the problem. I need to get... Well, that's all messed up now. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. There I go. It's another one of those dudes. Going this way. Don't mind me. It does not work. Maybe works. I don't know. That seemed too... That seemed too easy! I'm going! Oh god! He's going down! Shut the door, Cap! Whoa! Lock the door! It's locked! What's going on? Put the stuff! Put the stuff! Off another one of WoW's monsters. We have Put the stuff! We need, right? Did I? Yeah. Let's get to work. Oh... This is crazy. Did Don't I put worry, the it'll work. How do I Yeah, put the stuff. Just put the stuff, man. Just make sure put... it's all bunched together with the, put the stuff connecting all the parts. All right, try activating the seat from the terminal again. Oh my god, it's totally getting in here before we're done. I'm gonna have to remote control. Oh, this is what's gonna happen. I'm gonna have to sit in here and remote control that thing into the abyss. It's, it's gonna be through that body. Is that good? 
can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Oh, then why don't we get the suit? It's stressful. I was gonna suggest that if you refused. You'd go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it, change body. Yes, if you want to stay here, I'm not gonna stand in your way. I'm not staying here. I don't want here. to tell you what to do. What would it be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Oh God, I did not. He was right behind me. I could tell. Like that, it made it easy enough to sneak past it. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. You lost me halfway there. Yeah, me too. You don't really need to understand it. Just make them line up. <laughs> Science. So this is lower frequency. Okay. There you go. That's everything. You can climb into the pilot seat now. Already? I have everything under control. So please, have a seat. <sighs> go sit in the pilot seat. Yeah, shut up. God. Wish you wouldn't do that. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. It's like having a picture taken. But with the most expensive camera in the world. You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. <laughs> Watch that thing come in the room as it as this links out. This section will actually, well, at least so far, wasn't as scary as the last one. There must be something wrong. Can't you run a diagnosis or something? Okay. Um. What was that? No, I it just... Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn you, Kath. Two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. I can probably go kill myself. Me to react to this shit. Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. Whoa. What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in this fucking nightmare again? All alone? So cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if I kill him? What if he didn't need to wake up? You do that? Moral choice incoming. Maybe. There. I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer. Boop. Didn't even have to think about it. That's that's my call. I subscribe to the continuity theory. Do I... can I wait? Oh, he's gone. <laughs> one of us, one of us. No commentary from Catherine about that? About my choice? Better take this with me. Here we go. Oh boy. Into the abyss. I, uh, that's gonna probably do it for me tonight. If this is the end of the chapter. It looks like this is the end of the chapter, pretty much. 
That was a bit freaky, but not as freaky as I expected, as I thought it was going to be. The cool thing... Hold on, let me... So the, co the cool thing I think, or the other cool thing is, I don't even have to think about whether my other body would agree with the decision I just made. Because at the point of the, the switchover or the copy, both of you have the same um, the same experiences, the same neural pathways, etc. As uh, if you if you're doing that, if you really believe that it's a true copy, so then you know that both of you are going to agree at that point in time. So you don't have to feel bad about killing another copy of yourself. If you wait for like a year, or heck, even like a day or something, now you don't know whether. Um, whether you're the same person as as the copy, and you can't really make that decision. So I think that's cool. What's over here? Multiple jumping off points. Well, I'm not going to the one directly in front of me. I'm going to the one over here, man. This one's cooler. Is this over the abyss? Because this is freaking cool. Yeah, but it's me. Both my copy and me have the full information about our, our feelings and experiences. And we know that we have the exact same feelings and experiences. Also, yeah, I don't want to... Like, if I fail down in the abyss, I don't want that guy to wake up and have to live nightmare hour for the rest, rest of the time. That's, that's the other reason. Would I give my life for a new me that I wouldn't experience? You know, I, I think I might. I, th I think I might. I mean, I could just drop here, but I don't think that's what they want me to do. Alright, so that's why there's two of them. Exactly. How dare it. Exactly. Whoa, what's that over there? No, but... I... At the point I copied, I should be able to make the like me and my clone should be able to make the same make that same decision. I guess I guess it's a slightly your experiences have slightly diverged. I guess you need to you need to have thought about it beforehand and made your decision beforehand. Are we done here? Yeah. Activate the clamor, please. Sure thing. Activate the what? Do I have to like push a button or something? No, just sit down. Yeah, pretty much. Is it doing it? I don't think I did it. Yeah, I guess so. You need to you need to kind of decide beforehand, and like you have to have an agreement. You you have to have a decision in mind. I don't know. Before going into it, oh, two. Well, that's why. Activate the what, please? Oh. That big lever. Take a seat and we'll be off. Why are there two passengers?
But even genetically identical twins have, I guess, put the potential for mutations. And also, the potential for different experiences inside the womb. My real me died like a hundred years ago. Is there still room for me? And what about the Simon I killed at Omicron? Proof contact. Sweet whale. Is there a heaven full of redundant copies of the same people? There's someone up there who called me an imposter. It's dumb luck, right? That I woke up in the right body. They basically flipped a coin, and if I had called the wrong side, I'd be rotting away at Omicron. I mean, there's nowhere to know, right? You didn't hit the make sure Simon wakes up in the right body switch, did you? Not that you would know. I mean, he would still claim to be the right Simon. Christ. <laughs> This is awful. Sure, we did. did an awful fucking thing. And you wouldn't mind. Why would you? How could you know that it's not me, the me that I am, the same that I've always been? Let me say something. I don't want to think. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to upset you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I had to, you know, tuck my arm so I could push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge and, you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair and the sun was setting and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? The Both, deep I guess. world? When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. Even if we make it to the yard, would it be any different? still be alone. The Law and Order episode. No friends. No family. You could make new friends. I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have... Figured that was gonna happen. Oh my god. Catherine? Kath? Hello, Catherine. What happened? <laughs> Oh my god, what is gonna happen here? This probably is a good stopping point. Wait, what? Oh, sweet. This is also cool. This is scary, but also cool. Yeah, this is a good stopping point. Oh my god, what? So rad. This is like half the episodes of, uh, well, it's not a clone. This is half the episodes of uh, Arrested Development. Pop Pop and Oscar. Yeah, I gotta, I can't. It's all. It's almost 11. And uh, I can't do too much of this at a sitting. It's too stressful. Oh, probably, uh, we must be getting close to the end at this point. So... Maybe, maybe tomorrow we'll be able to finish it. Ooh, uh, ooh, uh, oh, 
Oh, thanks, St. Nicholas. It certainly had its moments. Thanks, you guys. <laughs>